This video is about an increase in the authorized shares and why you don't always have to panic whenever you see an increase in authorized shares. As you can see, Opti was cruising along here and then the company made a filing of increasing the authorized shares. And what happens in a situation like this and people who don't understand what's going on, they'll post something negative and then a bunch of other people who really don't know what's going on will pick up on the negativity and then the panic sell-off begins. And having knowledge and awareness of what's going on here and knowing that you don't have to panic will help you to avoid a situation like this. But it's unfortunate that people who really don't understand just end up jumping out. And then all the people who understand how this works and they're not worried a bit, they're down here loading up when this thing bottoms out. So whenever you see an increase in the authorized shares, it's really not any big deal. A lot of times the company is just making an increase because they foresee in the future that they might need to use those shares as leverage in order to create another major deal or to seek some serious funder and even though it might be a debt situation most times the debt doesn't come due for a year or two and Reli here r-e-l-i they increased their authorized shares from 1 billion to 2 billion for potential acquisitions or mergers that would be beneficial to the company and now look at the company a year later if you would have bought even down when it settled in here at 13 cents six months later you would have had five times your money at 53 cents but anyway just an education about an increase in authorized shares to let you know depending on the company and as long as it's something that seems like they have a good product like Opti has here and you're holding this, nothing to worry about that increase in authorized shares.